And welcome to a game that really should have pulses racing. Every reason to believe this will be enthralling. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Elche facing Barcelona. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And now they get the ball rolling. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Marc-André Ter Stegen in goal. Frenkie de Jong plays with Sergio Busquets in central midfield. And the starting striker today is Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang. De Jong. Pedri. That is not going to do. Well wide of the target. Promising sequence. Well, they've won the ball back quickly, and the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. Quick thinking to dispossess his opponent. Do well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Promising move from Barcelona. Well, they're sitting ever deeper, and the referee has given the advantage to Barca. It's got to be there is the goal, and you could almost see that coming. They were sitting ever deeper, and now they've really paid the price. Well, here's another look, and you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Depay Jordi Alba Jordi Alba Busquets still looking to get the shot off on and on he goes Depay Strong but fair tackle. Fidel. Very quick thinking there. They all know their roles as they apply the pressure. Making progress. but really sticking to their task defensively. And crossed in there. So Stegen was always going to make that save. Dembele. De Jong. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. A very good tackle. Will it happen for them? He made it look simple, really. So inching towards half-time, and Barca with the lead. Stuart, what strikes you about what they put into the first half? 
Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going at half-time if it stays like this. Super tackle, and he's in. It's got to be. Aubameyang. They've gone and scored again. They're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back. Let's take another look, and you have to say the defending is so poor. That's far too easy. The keeper had no chance there. So 2-0 now. A stoppage time situation. One minute here. What an opportunity. Magnificent from Mark andre Ter Stegen. Well, these fans can sense an opportunity here. They need to make the most of this corner. Playing it in. And so it is. The first half story has been written. And I think it's fair to say he's had happier days in front of goal, Stuart. Yeah, he's been well marshaled so far. But he hasn't worked the... So the second half is underway, and I must say it really was a spellbinding performance from Barcelona in the first 45. Tackling and winning the ball to boot. Lucas Boyer. Mascarel. Peremilla. Real chance. Well, flinging himself at the ball. Trying to pick out a teammate. And the keeper was finally able to claim it. Well, what a great piece of goalkeeping. Firstly the save, and then the recovery. Brilliant from him. And they do like to press whenever they can. Takes aim! And what a magical save it was! So the corner played into the box. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Well, when you see those stats, it's amazing how they're trailing in this game because they've created so many chances. They just haven't... He must finish! And it goes to alter the arithmetic and give them hope that they can turn this round. Well, here's the replay. And when you've got the ball at the back, you've got to pass it forward. And he doesn't do that there. He has his pocket picked, and he's been rightly punished. So on with the match. 2-1 is the scoreline. What's going to happen next? Frankie de Jong. And Aubameyang now. The pie. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Palacios. Pretty good reading of the game to win possession back. Could be troublesome, but nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Pedri. Now Busquets. PK. Twenty minutes to go. Pedri. De Jong. Pierre Emerick Aubameyang. The pie. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle.
playing with purpose and control. Will he find the net? And with that, they've thwarted the opportunity. Well, just listen to the atmosphere in here. The fans doing every bit to try and spur their team on for this equaliser. Promising move from Barcelona. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Bumbao. Mojica. And you've got to keep the ball a bit better than that. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. Possession one. Well, that's how to break the spirit of the attacker. Gumbau. Well, still time for them to level it, but really sticking to their task defensively. But if truth be told, he made it rather straightforward. And that is that very satisfying from the Barca point of view. A victory here. What did you think of their overall display? Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today. But overall, they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, a meaty role played by Frankie de Jong. Sensational performance from him on all levels. Stuart, as always, very keen to get your analysis. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well. He scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round. to be there is the goal and you could almost see that coming they were sitting ever deeper it's got to be Obama Yang. they've gone and scored again they're doing everything in their power to make sure they're not pegged back